Well, we just finished up check day number six. I won't bore you with the details on checking the same 12 trap locations every day because it's really not that exciting anymore. We're just doing a job and we had a slight uptick today. Um, five in the bottom, one in grandma and grandpa's yard. So the five in the bottom uh, brings the total to 44 in six days. I think last year we were sitting at 80. So, but last year we had a slight uptick on days six, seven, eight. So this is why we run a 10 day trapping period. You never know what you're gonna catch unless you have traps set. And if you've got the time, and this this here, it takes longer for me to drive to this farm from my house than it does to check them. So if I lived close, you know, it wouldn't take, you know, 30 to 40 minutes in the morning. I'm done, I can I can go on about the rest of my day. But, uh, you know, and, and even if you have a big farm that's, you know, or a small farm that's not close to your house, if you can find a kid to do this, they have a blast, they learn a lot, and you know you get you get done what you need to get done and if you feel inclined to pay them pay them but we're going to keep running them i don't think we're going to have a, a you know a big double digit catch day ever again this spring um i think we've knocked out that resident population turkeys can finish their nesting cycle and then next spring we'll come back in we'll do the same exact thing so we'll do daily checkups for day seven eight nine ten and just keep on rocking